the cross is our victory why did jesus choose to die on the cross why did jesus choose to pay such a heavy price for us because the cross means our victory the cross means our salvation first corinthians chapter 1 verse 18 For the message of the cross is foolishness to those who are perishing but to us who are being saved it is the power of God God reveals to us that the cross is his best idea while it seemed as a stumbling block to the Jews and it seemed as foolishness to the Greeks what we find in the gospel is the very power of God power of God for what the power of god unto salvation there's nothing that can save us from the power of sin there's nothing that can redeem us uh, from the effect of sin that the world is in after the first man adam sinned there's a need for another human being sinless to pay the price to break uh, what begun in the garden of eden and jesus has done it for us and the power of salvation is that power of rescue that sets us free from the clutches of sin from the clutches of of satan um and and everything that that he has upon us and so Uh, as we trust in what jesus has done for us you now we can receive the victory of the cross we can live with the victory of the cross uh, and we can overcome uh, anything that the enemy brings upon us uh, with the power of the gospel now uh, we also read in romans chapter 6 and verse 6 uh, that knowing this that our old man was crucified with him that the body of sin might be done away with that we should no longer be slaves of sin now uh, human beings you know, we have a part of us known as the flesh uh, which intends to do evil you know, which craves to do what is wrong uh, and so the power of sin lives on the inside of every single one of us and and the bible says that the tendency of the flesh uh, is something that we cannot overcome with our will power it's not something we can overcome with with um, uh, motivation it, it's it's not something we can overcome with our human efforts but we need the power of god to break the hold of sin over us uh, and so this verse from romans 6:6 uh, is is shedding light on the fact that uh, the old man was crucified uh, and the body of sin can now be done away with because jesus has paid the price for the power of sin he has broken the power of sin over us and the last part of the scripture also says that we should no longer be slaves of sin which means that we are now set free if jesus were not to die on the cross we we could still have this excuse of sin tempting us and uh, and leading us in the wrong path but now that jesus has paid the price for us uh, the power of sin over our lives uh, when we are believers in the lord jesus the power of sin is broken over our lives and so we can live a life of freedom uh, when it comes to sin we can live a life uh, of overcoming we are overcomers through Christ Jesus and so Christ Jesus is our victory let's pray together heavenly father we thank you that through you we have the victory god this day i declare the power of the cross over people's lives the victory of the cross over people's lives of oh god father your word says that you always lead us in triumphant victory lord whatever circumstances people are going through father i pray that lord they will arise uh, above everything oh god because of the victory of the cross over their lives god i pray uh, those who are entangled oh god in in uh, sinful habits god that the the power of sin god lord let it be broken over them as, as they put their faith in this truth lord we thank you for what you've done we honor you and we love you in Jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally for more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk please visit apcwo.org